Hello world, it's Curtis Potter with Boundless Inspiration. Today I wanted to talk to you about what happens if you hesitate for even one second. So I heard this on uh, on some podcast the other day or, or uh, motivational talk. And the guy was talking about how if you hesitate for even one second, what happens in your mind is it automatically starts producing doubt, fear, uh, anxiety, you know, just all these negative thoughts. And the longer you allow those thoughts to continue happening, the less likely of a chance that whatever you hesitated on, you're going to actually do because you've created so much fear and doubt in, inside your mind that now, since your body's naturally supposed to protect itself, you know, you, um, you know, we naturally are judgmental because it's to protect yourself. We're naturally being hesitant, you know, in ways to protect yourself. But when you're trying to achieve a goal, that hesitation can actually have an opposite effect where it's actually negative instead of, um, you know, protecting you. So I heard this and I was like, you know what, that kind of makes sense. And then not even an hour later, I get a call from my buddy. Um, he was talking about how he had been hesitating to fix his truck for a long time. And we had talked about this multiple times. I told him, I said, man, my, my grandfather owns a mechanic shop. Just take it there. Well, see, the thing is, is he was worried it had something to do with his rear end and four wheel drive. He's like, man, I've actually already gotten a couple quotes and it was around $1,500. And, you know, unfortunately, I just don't have that to drop into my truck right now. He has multiple vehicles. He's like, I'll just drive the other one. And once I get my money right, I'll go ahead and, uh, you know, fix it. We'll see. He finally did get his money right to where he was in a position where he's like, all right, I've got that extra $1,500 to spend on this truck. Took it in. They started tearing some stuff apart and actually evaluating it. And come to find out, it, all it was was a, a link and the four-wheel drive transfer case. With labor, it ended up costing him $97. And he's like, man, Curtis, I, I can't believe that I, I had my truck sitting for like a year. And I had all this worry and, and frustrations. There's times where he was... He was mad. He almost sold the truck, he, you know, for probably a lot less than he, he could have really got out of it because he didn't fix that part. And if someone would have drove it, they would have known instantly there was something wrong. But that just goes to show you that it's true. You know, he hesitated for one second because as soon as something started messing up, he's like, oh, man, it's going to cost me a lot of money. He just took it and, and just talked to the mechanic about what was probably going wrong. And they said, well, it's probably going to be $1,500 or around there. Maybe a little more, maybe a little less. But, buddy, I'm telling you, it's going to be about at least over $1,000. So he hesitated. It created fear. It prevented him from having his truck for almost a year. And then once he got past that, you know what? That was a false fear. You know, fear is false evidence appearing real. And if you hesitate for just even a second... Instead of having belief in yourself, knowing like, hey, you know what? I'm going to get this fixed, get it evaluated and find out for sure what's going on. Then I'll evaluate at that moment if I have the money to do it. You know, if you have a dream and you hesitate for just a second, instead of just going all in, that can cause months and months and months of hesitation and, and really waste time, which you can't buy more of. Once that clock is over of your time, it's over. And you know, folks, um, I, I admit that there's been plenty of that that I've had in my life. I've hesitated. I've dragged my feet. I've created some worry in my mind, that false evidence appearing real. And it robbed me of that precious time that I could never get back. So I invite you to ask yourself, are there things that you're hesitating and worrying about and causing yourself to lose a lot of time and you're not even positive if you should even be worrying or if that is a false evidence appearing real. I mean, it, that happens to so many people. I hear it all over. Today, I challenge you, whatever you've been hesitating on, move forward. Take a couple steps forward and just see where you're at for sure.
because you never know you might be on the other side of that beauty just like him 97 dollars. i got my truck back i don't have to drive the car anymore i'd rather drive a truck because i'm a dude so what is it that you're hesitating on and if you know somebody else that needs to hear this you know that you're you're great friend or family member just somebody you work with and you just you see so much potential inside them and and you can hear their goals and dreams and what they're going after and you know inside your heart like man just go after it that's why i was telling everybody i was like dude just take it in there and have them rip it apart you know I, even at my grandfather's shop ralph's muffler shop they'll do free estimates so they'll actually hook the computers up and see what's wrong with it for free tell you what's wrong with it and then they would have said, hey, buddy, it's only $97. You want to go ahead and do that today? Yep, I'm going to do that. Yep, I'm going to go after my goals. Yep, I'm going to take that first step. Please like, share, comment, tag somebody in this post. Because then, even if you know, like, I was that buddy that was telling him, like, dude, just take it in. Dude, just take it to my grandpa's shop. Dude, come on. Like, dude, that's you're just worrying for no reason. You, it may not even be that. But it was a struggle for him to listen to me and be like, you know what, Curtis, you know, I should take your advice and go ahead and do that. And instead, he took his own. He took the, the fear that that mechanic shop gave him and he hesitated. So maybe if you like, share, comment, tag somebody and send in their DM and they see me, maybe somebody, I, they don't even know me, but they're like, you know what, that, that makes perfect sense. The way you said that, yes, that's what I've been doing in my life. That's the only way these videos are not only going to help you, but the people you know that I don't know and hopefully just inspire the world to quit hesitating even for a second, walk in that confidence and achieve their dreams and goals. Well, folks, I love you. I appreciate everyone that continues to follow along, support me. And you know the drill, one step closer to being balanced. Have a great day.